Welcome to Tell You Later, the show where we guarantee a laugh or your money back. Thanks to all those who support us on Patreon. By the way, there's always room for more. And don't forget to like and subscribe to their channel. Glass to be tall spive here. Vanilla. Co-hosts of Welcome to Later. And when we're not doing that... We're watching Tell You Later. Join us, will you? It's our job, you see. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget. Don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe. And do not fail to hit the subscribe button. And while you're at it, hit like. Right now. Hit it! We haven't got a title song for this show, so we're singing this thing instead. Okay. It's really just a substitute. Nonetheless, a melody may stay in your head. Oh, I hope so. Because it's a tune. It's a tune. You'll love to croon. You'll love to croon. Ah, but there's one thing you should know. We have to confess we do not possess a title song for this show. Ain't it peculiar? Believe it or not. We haven't got a title song for this show. Again, I'm told. Oh, I can't you remember. always forget. All right, then remind me. It's Witcherella. Witcherella, and I'm Witcherula. Yeah. Because <laughs> I Witcher. ride the Bruma. <laughs> yeah, and I ride the Turbo XL Sweeper 2000. <laughs> That's right. And, all right, so we want to tell you what we're planning this year. <laughs> but first, we want to thank all of you yes, for supporting yes. us here at <laughs> Tell You Later. <laughs> Where we've gone mad! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so. and Bounty! <laughs> <laughs> and that's all year for her. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I'm planning Don't on making... You know, look, I'm a witch from Minnesota. <laughs> all right, so I'm tr planning on making a witch's brew this year that's going to be so tasty because I'm putting in it. <laughs> Hi, I'm Katie Lee. And I'm the crew of one. And we're here to tell you a little secret. Guess what? Did you know you can access any and all of our content for free until the end of the month? Mm-hmm. Yes, I did. We call it Love Us or Leave Us. Why? Because you may know us from the Tell You Later show on YouTube, but you are missing a ton of content that we're working on, like... Welcome to Later, Adventures in Popcorn, 
the bonus episodes like our quarterly Zoom calls. Those are fun. And what is quickly becoming your most popular show ever, Five Star Cooking with Katie, which is, which is not available on YouTube or anywhere else. Yeah, just visit www.patreon.com and join at the Audissimo level for free. They don't bill until the first. Really? Really. So, what are you waiting for? Sign up to see what you've been missing. Love, Love us or, or leave us. us. <laughs> no. Oh. Little plump frogs. Oh, little plump frogs, my favorite little plump frogs. <laughs> plump frog. Ooh. What color are ah, they? They're just green and tasty. And, <laughs> and then, and, oh, sorry, I think I'm, and then. Oh, which spit? <laughs> which spit? Which it? spit? Oh, here's my ceramic pumpkin. Oh, it's for, it's you so know. special. Yes. yes. So I got a new toothbrush this year. Isn't uh, is my, oh, you had the same problem sh toothbrush I do. Well, I used yours, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> she just cracks me <laughs> up because you're a Walmart. <laughs> All right, so I wanted to share with you something very important. Are you, you ready? Is it a witch poem? It is. Oh, what is it? Witches are beautiful. Witches are bright. Witches are going to be flying by you. <laughs> Maybe I can wrap it. Witches are beautiful. Could you do like some music? <laughs> witches are beautiful. Witches are bright. Ooh, witches are gonna come by your house tonight. Oh, oh, oh! Right. <laughs> well, you know, some people in our audience, yeah, they are not that fond of witches, and I know why. Because normally they think of us as baddies and we're not we're very good witches no we really and actually yes. you are a very good witch on halloween <gasps> i know this because you love to take pictures of your little trick-or-treaters yes, don't you yes, yes I you do. do i'm a good witch are you a good witch are you a bad witch oh are that's you a good witch. let's do our glinda glinda the good are witch. you a good witch or a bad witch i believe i'm a good witch and a good witch is a good witch. I'm not a good witch at all. I'm a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> oh, doesn't that just make you hungry? <laughs> Actually, it's me, Katie Lee, Chris Anthony. Yeah, we're just wanting to have a little Halloween yeah, fun. Yeah, okay, it is us. I, it I, is us. And she okay. really does love how every how the truth is, and we know there are people of our our faith persuasion who maybe don't go all out like no, you do, no, but no, you no. We're do. Being just silly. You love to post Halloween cartoons, don't I you? I do. You I do. do. You have a collection of little. You have a collection of little <laughs> Halloween drawings and cartoons and sayings, don't you? Well, because Halloween's kind of a dark, yucky part of the year sometimes, so I try to make it fun and cute, and I don't do like really ugly, dead, bleeding people and skeletons. I put like fun Beyond things. Beyond this costume, most things are fun. Right. This yeah. is we're fun witches. We're not. We're not even witches, actually. But the thing is, I try to do fun things like uh, when kids come to my front door, I so like, pop I, out and scare them. <laughs> And no, I let them, we pick the best costume. And so we have like a group of kids. And I say, okay, we, who's the winner here? And I had some little kid who was dressed up with like a box. And he had like all these things like popcorn. He was a popcorn box. He was hysterical. He was okay, so cute. Okay, that, I need that for the show. If you have a picture, I we do. must have a popcorn costume box. As we'll have to show it. He was he was so fun. So I try to do fun things and make it fun for the kids because kids come to my door every year and they go, "We're gonna have a Halloween contest <laughs> at your front door." And I said, "Sure, let's eat candy." And, and how and old are they now? Twenty nine. Yeah, they're kind of old, <laughs> yeah, but you've been still, there a while. still, it's fun. And it's like if you you bring the fun to it, and it's like when they come, I always say, "Okay, who can do the best uh, laugh? Who can do the scariest laugh?" And I just make up stuff. You're fun. so good. Do you? Are you one of those houses that gives out chocolate? Yeah. Yeah, you are. You're one of the good houses. I am. Yeah. Okay, I give out chocolate because I want chocolate. <laughs> you want what's left over, right? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I know how that works. I like bubble gum. <laughs> 
And bubblegum is good at Halloween, isn't it? <laughs> I know. People don't. Yeah, I try to hand out Triscuits. No, they don't go over very well. You know, what about those houses that hand out fruit? Yeah. I'm no, sorry. Maybe you hand out fruit. Anymore. No, yeah. I mean, that, I don't mean to make but fun of your But do you get a lot of kids? You do. Yeah, you have I a still big, do. They, like, and because they, they know you give out chocolate. <laughs> yeah. Right? And I, my husband... He um he he eats a lot. You're of it a too. witch with a husband. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, I, I forgot. But I yeah I do. And he always says buy the good stuff. And I go, honey, it doesn't matter if I buy all the good stuff. He goes, yeah. And I know why. I know why because he's eating it. And daddies, I think daddies made up Halloween because yeah. daddies are the ones that really <laughs> want to eat all that stuff, right? And mommies yes. are like, oh good, I washed pants with a sucker in it. That's fantastic. Now what are we gonna wear to school tomorrow? Tomorrow, right? <laughs> She's a mom. You can tell by that. Only moms one, think of one, like <laughs> one Thanksgiving. I have a picture. It was it wasn't Halloween? Oh, okay. but I used to dress up like a pilgrim and tell pilgrim jokes at school. How cute is yes, that? Yes, I That's like so that. Cute. Yes. Yeah. Would you like to hear a pilgrim joke? Absolutely. I know it's. So we not. already did our thing. Okay. Okay. No, I'm kidding. Go ahead. We already did our Thanksgiving little special, but hey, I, I wrapped. I wrapped the poem. I mean, you can. Why definitely... did the turkey? No, wait, that's not it. Oh, no. Wait, We're going to be here a while. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold it's on. It's going to be Christmas well, we all soon. Know, we all know. If, if Thank you so much to all you patrons who help us out there. We really appreciate your support. Thank you, everybody who's buying merch on Merch Later. Go to my website, katielee.com, and see. There's all kinds of cool stuff, and you can see it there. Or on Merchalator.com. And also, those who listen on Anchor, I want to shout out to you guys because I know there's a bazillion of you out there who listen and really appreciate you too. <laughs> if April showers bring Mayflowers, what do Mayflowers bring? <gasps> Pilgrims! Yes! Yay! Okay. Why did the turkey not want to eat on Thanksgiving? I don't know why. Because he was already stuffed. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, bum. So, do you know any good Halloween jokes? Oh, no. You don't? Well, I do have, well, not to change it, I don't know that, but I was asked, wanted to ask you, what do you think about my hat if I wore it a little tilted like a French hat? Oh, yeah. Like a, like a French, you know what? like a little bit that of a French a very, That is a very good look for you. You like this? Oh, you like this. That is it's a very good, like good look for you. French. Should I tilt my hat as well? Yeah, tilt your hat too. I will tilt my hat. I hope I don't poke you in the eye. <laughs> <laughs> Do you notice that my French witch has a purple hair? Ah, oui, I have a purple hair. I have green You have the green verd, hair. Verd. As we say in France. Oh, well, I don't know French because oui. I'm a fake Frenchy witch. You're a fake French witch. <laughs> <laughs> which witch is which? Oh, oh, which witch is which? <laughs> witch. <laughs> so, what, is, what was what? Okay, so you got a popcorn Halloween costume. My nephew once had an obsession with elevators. And wow. Yeah, so he wanted to be an elevator. For Halloween, he did. Yeah, so I we I flew to Atlanta to help my stepmother create an elevator costume for my nephew that's Charlie a, Rose. That's creative, and it was pretty amazing. Yeah. What we made, we'll show a picture of it. It's, I would love yeah, to see that. And it looked like there was somebody trying to escape the elevator because these skeleton hands that's were so in cute. there. That's so cute. Yeah, it was that's pretty very cool. creative. That's he un- wore it for like five minutes and then was- <laughs> and then it's like I can't wear yeah, it. I can't wear it, it anymore. <laughs> yeah, I don't like getting dressed. You probably can't tell, but Halloween is not one of my favorite actually. Um, occasions because you don't like getting dressed up, huh? I love no, I love to be a French witch. That is fine. No, I'm not a very big dresser upper person. Oh, wow! I, I, you know, because I, I don't like makeup. Oh. Wow. Yeah, isn't that that's why I'm a voice actor? Oh, that's why because I yeah. was wondering. And because every year too for Halloween, it seemed that we always had to be either well when we were kids, they had these. Plastic. Oh masks yeah, the plastic. That you couldn't really breathe. You can't in. breathe. With one of your face, they had this like that little, st- the little uh, elastic, elastic thing went behind that had your head. Metal. 
that's stuck in your face. I remember I was Casper once, I think. I had oh, a Casper a mask. Yeah. That was that was okay, but it was hard to see because their cutout eyes were like <laughs> sharp. I mean, it was deadly. So then I didn't want to do that. So then, I don't know, did your family ever do this? This is, they got the big idea. We will be hobos. Oh, hobos so you are have your to, go-to when you so have you no have costume. you have to burn a cork and rub <laughs> cork all oh, over your face, oh, 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 which I oh. guess is supposed to be like a beard, Yes, yes. because hobos can't grow hair, <laughs> so they have to put these fake beards on, and so... Hobos are what you were when you had no costume. <laughs> yeah. You just pull out all your junky clothes in the closet, my, and you put... <laughs> right, I'm a hobo. And then you just draw on your face, and you go, I'm a hobo! <laughs> or, or gypsy. Gypsy is where you put on oh, 5,000 gypsy ones. Yeah. yeah, necklaces and a big skirt. Because you don't and, have to wear And you put makeup. a scarf on your head. Mm-hmm. Yeah, these are go-to in case, yeah. you know. But I did do, one year I had that plastic face with, a, it was a Wonder Woman face. Oh. And it was like, she had like this black hair and this, it was like really ugly. But my mom ugly. was like, honey, you're going to be... Um, Wonder, Woman? Wonder Woman and the mask goes over your face and you can't breathe you're just the whole time you're walking you're kind of hyperventilating <laughs> and you can't see because the eyes are never big right. enough so you're kind of and it's like I remember thinking I don't feel like Wonder Woman at all <laughs> <laughs> we used to take pillowcases <laughs> Another to go-to. collect candy in <laughs> oh yeah oh yeah yeah <laughs> We would do that, or be a ghost, find an old sheet. Come. So nowadays, people go buy their costumes, but when we were kids, we ma- oh, made yeah. them most of the time, right? <laughs> now you go to party, what you call it, one of those stores, and it's like they got a million costumes of, up on the wall. $500, $700, $1,000 $1, for and your costume. And you know who costume. really wants to wear them are adults. Yeah. It's not even yeah. the, the little kids. They don't. You know, I, I like, as you could tell from our previous episodes, I'm, I like to make things yes, myself. Yes, so, you definitely do. Uh, one time Adam wanted to be Peter Pan, so oh, I just no, brought him green, Adam. green thermal <laughs> underwear, you know, and I made him a hat. And he was adorable, a little bell. Oh. <laughs> we did that. Um, but then when he was in high school, I think he dressed as a Canadian how do you dress as a Canadian? He had a plaid shirt, pair of jeans. Oh, that's going, that's going that's, all out. I know. That's, that's really going that's, out. That's even lazier than hobo. Is. <laughs> <laughs> well, this year at my door, I know, because the things are a little bit different with the whole... Oh, oh! you've got your new uh, Tell You Later tote bag. Isn't it cute? I love yeah, it. Did you get that at Merchelator? I sure did. Merchelator.com. It's so cute. It, look. Super tell cute. Tell Ya Later bag. And That's it's got awesome. everything in it. Do I they got... have hats? Ow. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, COVID thing going on. Hello. I think, you know, I'm, going, I'm still not giving it up. I'm going to make it as fun as I possibly can. What's, your, hold... what's your plan? My plan is when the kids come... I'm, I'm going to say, okay, stay back, stand back, but we're going to have our contest anyway because I won't give You could shoot them with silly string. Oh, that would go over really good, and the <laughs> parents would probably lock me up. But it's funny because you do see the parents. You know how parents kind of stand back and they let their kids go up to the door, mm-hmm. and the parents are back there looking at their little child going, oh, how cute, look how cute he is. But there was this one year where I opened the door, ding dong, trick or treat, and I see this whole family dressed. It was like all of them were dressed like the in Incredibles. Car- the da- the dad, no, I wish the dad. Uh, it was the mom. There was like two kids, and it was like they had a wagon and stuff, and they're all dressed up in in costumes. Th- the thing was, it's like I couldn't tell what any of them were because <laughs> they all made up costumes. You know, it's like it's like look at us, and usually I go, oh, you're a captain of a ship, or oh, look at you, you're a ballerina. But they were just so mixed up in their costumes. I went. Oh, Oh, wow. Check that out. What a group you are. Wow, I love what you did. I wonder what they were. I don't think it was important. It was a family. It was a family thing. It was so sweet that I took their picture and they all posed. You know, yeah, you it, have quite a collection of, of Halloween evening <laughs> event pictures. We did Harvest Festival. Oh, that's so great. that was we we hard we didn't really go to trick or treating much. We had have stuff at our. So you know, you asked me about Christmas stories. I don't have big Christmas stories, but one of my children. Uh, was a present from Romania. And his first day in America 
was Halloween. Oh. And I felt so sorry for him. He arrived on well, my my daughter. I have a daughter whose birthday is October 30th. I was just praying she wouldn't be born on Halloween, but she's real close. And then he arrived on her birthday. And the next day was Halloween, so we oh. all got dressed. Confusion, total confusion. I on know, that. poor kid. I mean, I feel so. I was. I just don't do that to your. Don't no, do that. Don't ever so do he, that. So he 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 had no idea what Halloween was. Everybody was dressed up. It was like a crazy yes. night, you know. I, he, we were flinging chickens in pots <laughs> and and playing all these games. And I thought, how is he ever going? But I am proud to say he is now a paramedic. <laughs> Um, and saving people, saving from people themselves. from people like us. <laughs> yes, and he's like a, a trainer. But that was a little. That was. I felt so sorry for him. Yeah. Have you ever showed up to a party and you thought it was a costume party, Valerie, and, and, and you and it wasn't? <laughs> Have you? Once, really? but it, actually, it was for an audition. They wanted they wanted a um, a wait a waitress a bar ma- waitress where they wanted. Um, they, they called it like a, a... And you were a waitress once. Well, I... So once, you know so how I, to do I, that. But I dressed up in this waitress outfit, and I had on, like, I even brought the tray, and I, I was like, this waitress, so cute. And it was like, it wasn't for a waitress. They, all these women were in beautiful gowns and oh, beautiful... No. They were just like the opposite of it. What, what happened? I don't know. I don't know what happened, but I still need therapy about it. But <laughs> I showed up, and I had on this tray with this waitress outfit and I looked like this little misfit. People don't know what actresses have to go Oh, and I walked into the room and it was a call. I forget why I got waitress, waitress. How I got that but anyways, I walked in and it was all these beautiful women. What were they really supposed to be? Like like Uh, Miss Universe? I don't know how that I got it messed up but these women were all beautiful. I bet you heard cocktail party and thought it was cocktail waitress. Oh my gosh, that's it! I bet that was it. I bet that I wa- was it. I walked into this cocktail waitress, waitress outfit, ugly as like a little misfitty thing, and all these beautiful people. So, what men did the casting there there. people they, say? They, I, I don't think I got the job. <laughs> what did they say? <laughs> they said, oops. Well, were what they ta- nice? Were the they, member? they laughed and they says, you know, okay, well, did you, you didn't get, get the memo, huh? <laughs> <laughs> they go, did you just get off work? I went. <laughs> did I just get off work? <laughs> you, I just, <laughs> yes, I, I yeah, just I, got off work. Can I get work. you something to drink while I'm here? Boil, boil, <laughs> toil and trouble. I will be back after this Halloween. <laughs> So, I have another story I can tell you about Halloween. <gasps> oh, goody, I want to hear it. <laughs> but I will tell you later. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Tell You Later is a Patreon driven entertainment show. So, what are you waiting for? Come on over, join us for so much more at patreon.com front slash tell you later. I didn't wink on nine on nudge to slightly. Cause I never said yes